guys, this is Manon. Uh, today it's a very special day because it's my sister's birthday and I would like to uh, tell her happy birthday, but I will do this in French. Bonne fête, Lorraine. Écoute, t'es ma grande sœur, je t'aime, puis je te souhaite de passer une super belle journée. Okay, so now, while I'm at it, uh, might as well say a few words in French to my family in France that I love very dearly and I miss, you can imagine. So here it is. Alors, bonjour à tous mes amis, euh, tous mes cousins qui sont en France, euh, que j'aime, que j'adore. Vous me manquez terriblement. Puis aujourd'hui, je vais faire une toile pour vous autres. Euh, ce qu'on appelle un wing pour. Alors, un wing signifiant des ailes. Alors, pour tous mes anges qui sont en France, que j'aime, que j'adore, je vous porte dans mon cœur. Celle-là, c'est pour vous. So... As I was saying, <laughs> uh, I was saying that today I would like to do a wing pour. So I want to do it on a 12 by 24 canvas. And um, so it, you know, it's easier when you have a longer uh, canvas. So uh, let, you, let me bring you down on the canvas and I will show you my colors for today. See you in a bit. Okay, guys. Uh, as I was saying, I wanted to do it on a 12 by 24 inch canvas, a gallery wrap by Michael's uh, Artist Loft canvas. Um, now, I will show you my colors for today. I'm just going to wear my glove because it's very important. I just don't want it to get too messy. Okay. Now today, I would like to do it on a blue base coat. Uh, you know, I want it to be like angels in the sky. So this is Artist Loft Blue. Um, the acrylic pour blue here. Uh, I thin this down a little bit. So it doesn't leave a mound on a mound. And then for my colors, we will have uh, Payne's Gray. This is a lot thicker. Uh, yeah, a mound on a mound. I'm going to put a lot of white in here. So this, one's, this one too is a titanium white and it's pretty thick too. Hope it's not too thick though. And then we have Deco Art Ice Blue beautiful color. It's a metallic from DecoArt. Ice blue. This is from Pebeo Studio. Uh, blue green iridescent. This is one of my favorite colors. Uh, and then we have uh, Pebeo Studios in silver. Mound and mound. Just like the others. You know the stick when it, the stick can stand up? That's okay. And this is my favorite of all. It's uh, from Deco Art. It's Peacock Blue. No shimmer, no, you know, no glitter in here. Just pure, beautiful. It's a lilac blue a little bit. I mean, violet blue. I just love this blue. So it's called Peacock Blue. And the last one is uh, Light Blue from Artist Loft. This one too is uh, amount on amount. So here we go. We're going to start off by flooding the canvas. Um, I'm going to put some music on for you while I do that and speed it up a little bit. So see you in a second.
Okay, so now we are going to layer our cup. Uh, I think I will do it here. I think you can see. Just maybe push this aside a little bit. Yeah. This is a 12 ounce cup. I need about 10 ounces to cover this uh, canvas. So I will start off with a little Payne's Gray at the bottom. Then some white. Nice layer of white. And then this ice blue. Iridescent blue-green. Silver. And then this beautiful blue. And some white again. And then the light blue. And I will go back to the Payne's Gray. With some white. And some white again. Silver. Light blue. I guess I, could, I should stop now. I have plenty. Okay, I'll push these aside. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm excited, I'm nervous because it's the first time I do a uh, wing pour. Uh, let's do it. So I'm going to just lift the canvas and put this underneath in the middle. Hope it holds. Okay, here's my layered cup. It's pretty nice. Hope I get the effect that I want. So I'm going to start right here. going on here. Well, so 
All right, so hands lemon. Just going to pop the air bubbles in here because there's a lot of them. Even in the base coat because I just did that color. beautiful lady here. I don't know why I say a lady because it could be a, a he. It's important not to leave a lot of paint on your canvas because sometimes it could crack while drying. And we have a little gooper here. Okay, well, I think I'm going to bring you down in this one because I, I think it's really pretty and I'm very happy with it. Yeah, I'm going to torch it one more time. Oh yeah. There's a lot of little bubbles in here. enjoying this one. Okay, let me bring you in. Okay, here it is. This is just, here's the paint gray in the middle, paint's gray. Look at all those lines here. 
think it's very pretty. Yeah, a little bit of cell action here. Not much. I turned off the studio lights, but maybe I should have left them on. Okay, already we have the glare of the lights on top. So this is it, guys. I will show you when it's dry. And I would like you to leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Uh, put, a, put a thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribe to my channel and um, in any time you want to reach for me you can always um, uh, leave, shoot me an email at manonpetitart at gmail.com and I'm on Facebook and Instra Instagram uh, manonpetitart so I'm everywhere you can find me <laughs> So till then, uh, I really want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. Uh, it means the world to me. I'm very, very happy to, especially to you guys, my new subscribers. Thank you so much. And uh, I will see you, well, I will see you soon. So au revoir. Hi, guys. So this is... Uh, the dried piece, uh, little wings, little angel wings. Um, I'm gonna show you up close the details. <laughs> There's a lot of shimmer in here. Look at all those lines. Aren't they pretty? Little cells down here yeah I really like this piece I hope you enjoy it and uh, hope to see you soon stay safe stay well and don't forget, I love you guys. Au revoir.